Ceramicist Shikamaru Takeshita works in the Tochigi region of Kanto, Japan. His father was also a ceramicist and gave him the drive to follow the path of being a professional ceramicist nearly 20 years ago when he was just 18 years old. In 2011, ceramicist Shikamaru Takeshita's oven was completely destroyed by the great earthquake of that year. When the time came to reconstruct, he decided to not make a traditional oven with two cooking chambers. Usually, the first chamber is for the fire itself and the second is for firing the created ceramics. Now the two are in the same room and the ashes float up and stick to the ceramics. It gives them a certain materiality, rough patches mixed with his untreated and minimalistic style. Once the fire is started, ceramicist Shikamaru Takeshita's team closes it by building a wall of bricks in front of the door. The temperature will reach up to 540 degrees. Ceramicist Shikamaru Takeshita and his friend alternate taking care of the fire. It fires for an entire week at a time. When the week is over, Takeshita's team waits for the temperature to get down to 212 degrees before taking down the brick wall and taking the ceramic pieces out. They need to go inside the oven to get all of the pieces out. Sometimes there can be as many as 700 ceramic pieces. Takeshita does everything by hand from beginning to end. He even gets the clay from his ceramics nearby in nature. He often does this in winter because there aren't any weeds then. After that, Takeshita dries the clay out and runs it through a screen to get all the stones and residue out. All materials from this video are from The Art of Sushi, published by NBM Graphic Novels, available where all books and ebooks are sold.